do you know that you can correct skin color using retouching academy i'm going to show you how to do that right now so we're going to be using this image right here as an example so if i just zoom in on this image you can see the colors of the skin right here and also the skin of the hands right here they're not looking uniform now here is how you can fix it easily with retouching academy you know before we have to use the gradient maps we have to sample colors and just fix it but this retouching academy method it's really really easy and it's really effective if you want to use it so if you have this retouching academy all you have to do is open it if you can't find it right here come to your windows come to your extension and you're going to see the beauty retouch right here you just click on it and it's going to open for you after that click on this magic skin tool right here once you click on this magic skin tool it's just going to load some groups for you it's going to open a couple of layers and load some group for you so once that group open all you have to do is pick your normal brush tool once you pick your normal brush tool set your opacity to 100 flow 100 make sure you're using a soft round brush make sure the color of your brush is on white and not a black brush because what i'm going to be brushing on is a black layer so make sure your brush color is set to white and you can see right here it says skin correction so just paint on the skin with your brush make sure to increase and decrease your brush size according to the part of the image you want to brush so i'm going to paint on this part right here on the skin just to even out the colors right there and just auto correct the colors right there and i'm going to do the same thing right here for the neck And I'm going to do the same thing for the hand right here. So this is really, really easy to use. Really, really easy. And it gives a good result. You can use this method or you can use the previous method. The both methods are really, really easy to use. There's more than one way to do the same thing inside of Photoshop. So I'm trying to share with you guys as many options as possible in case you are stuck and or maybe you don't have this retouching academy. You can use the other option and if you use touch academy you can use this option but for me i prefer to use that gradient map option because it's more accurate all right we are done let me show you the before and after this is the before this is the after you can see how even how uniform they are looking right now this before this is the after the before and this is the to duplicate the right here keep clicking on ctrl j to j to j to make the effect intense so you can see right now the effect in this so i'm just going to delete these layouts which i just created and also if you feel the effect is too strong all you have to do is come to your opacity right here and just reduce the opacity just like that so you can also use this magic skin tool to color grade your image and also to get that darkness on this skin to image if you want to watch how you can use this magic skin tool to color grade the image click on this video right here i'll see you guys in my next video stay creative